everybody, and welcome to Bits of Board, where we're talking board games, miniatures, cards, and dice. My name's Michael, and today we are checking out some of the Massive Darkness expansions. Today is all about the enemy boxes. So these provide new species or new inhabitants for our dungeons, giving the game a bit more variability uh, and giving dungeon masters and stuff a bit more of an opportunity to create their own story. We've got the Troglodytes, a humanoid barbaric themed race, and these guys come with a minotaur wandering monster. We've got the Rattlings, when these guys they're essentially our scaven, but they are much larger and much more fearsome on the field. We've got the Reptosaurians, now these guys are essentially our lizard men, but they come with a giant crocodile monster, so that's pretty cool. And finally we've got the Elementals, earth, wind, fire and water, all in their elemental form. I'm not looking forward to coming up against these guys. Oof. So we're going to go ahead and unbox these ones. Let's get stuck in. All right, guys, here we have the Troglodytes enemy box. Let's crack it open and have a look at the insides. Here we go. All right, we got some minis and we got some cards. So these will be all of the, the cards relating to our minis. Really, I just want to show these off. So let's jump in and have a look at these guys. Next up, we've got the Rattlings enemy box. And inside, we're gonna have some cards and a couple of other minis. Here we go, let's check these guys out. And now for the Reptosaurians, these dinosaur looking guys are sure to spice up the Massive Darkness game. Let me get this plastic off and we'll have a look. So we've got a ton of minis in there, a whopping wandering monster there. Let's check all these guys out. And last one for the enemy boxes, this is the Elementals pack. Let's just open this box and have a look at them. Haha! <laughs> so wow, these aren't actually as big as I thought they were going to be. Um, we'll have a close look at these properly, but I was thinking this guy would be about the size of that giant from from Blood Rage. Hang on. Alright, so I guess they're not that far off, but I was uh, I was expecting a little bit bigger. That's okay though, let us have a squiz at all of these guys. So yeah, awesome miniatures included here. Uh, definitely a great buy if you want to spice up your game, have that little bit more variability when you're pulling from your decks. Dungeon Masters out there, if you're looking to put together a campaign that is all yours, that's where these guys come in. You can really put together a story that explores that massive darkness world. There are a few similarities in the boxes, the Reptosaurians, Rattlings, Troglodytes, each have the same miniature count in them. So we're talking one group of 12 mobs and a boss one group of six mobs and a boss, an agent, 
and a wandering monster. So not too much variability there, but that's up to you to keep interesting. The Elementals was a really nice pick as well. Each one of those uh, representing their element beautifully. Wholly different miniatures there. I only wish they were a little bit bigger. So that's it for the enemy packs. We're gonna dive into the versus packs and have a look at those Kickstarter exclusive items. So stay tuned for that, but for the moment we're about done. So as always, my name's Michael, this is Bits of Board. We'll catch you next time.